Hey, this is Patrick with the Kentucky Gun Company. A couple months ago, we promised you that we was going to do some more obsolete weapons, some out-of-date weapons, some maybe forgotten weapons that you haven't seen. We did a Lottie, and we did a couple other oddball ones, and we keep getting more and more requests for these types of videos. So we thought we'd bring you something special today, something a little different, and um, we decided to do it from in our Ruger aisle. This aisle has probably housed, uh, I don't know, thousands and thousands of mini 14s and mini 30s in different and various configurations. Uh, we've seen them offered in the 762 by 39, the 6.8, obviously the 223. We've had that Ruger AC uh, AC556 machine gun in here. We've even had uh, we even had the 222s at one time. We had a batch that we imported from Europe uh, on, in a 222 caliber in a Mini 14. Some of you guys may or may not know those existed. But here's one that this uh, these racks have never housed, and here's one that most of you probably don't even know about or never heard about. But this is the Ruger XGI. And this is in a 308 caliber. And this was a gun that was never commercially produced, but we happen to have one here. And this is the Ruger XGI. From what we can gather, just doing some basic internet research, we've uh, determined that these were kind of first advertised in around 1984, 1985. Ruger was trying to increase their presence in the law enforcement market. And some of the law enforcement clients in that time were wanting a bigger caliber than the 556223. So Ruger decided to prototype some of these in a 308 caliber. And um, nifty little gun, but it never came to production because supposedly there was a lack or uh, they couldn't get the accuracy down, a lack of accuracy. So we have this happen, you know, this gun sitting in our safe here at KY Gun Co. And we really don't believe in safe queens. And through just again, just a little bit of internet research, we we can't find a video or uh, any video, any any mention of anybody actually shooting one of these, so today's the day. If you're a Ruger fan, you're gonna get to watch the XGI in action. All right, we got the 308 the Ruger XGI. We got the five rounds loaded in the mag. Keep in mind, if you ever see one of these on the shelf anywhere, be sure to grab it, because this is extremely rare. And they also made it in a 243, or prototyped it in a 243. But uh, like I said, a Kentucky Gun Company really don't believe in safe queens. No sense of having the gun unless you're going to shoot it. All right, mag load it. One in chamber. Five rounds, empty. We're only shooting at 15 or 17 yards there, so just open sights. And that is the Ruger XGI, ladies and gentlemen. If you like this video, you want to see more obsolete and cool stuff, give us a thumbs up, please subscribe.